everyone and welcome back to my channel first i must say that i am deeply grateful for your show of love on my first video your suggestions recommendations and encouragement they meant a lot to me and i'm deeply thankful if it's your first time joining us i'm so lucia and i'm back to welcome you in light of the compulsory worldwide holiday I believe that it is important that we all put in some extra work in our relationships and our marriages. One of the ageless problem way to do this is food. Yeah, make some extra effort. <laughs> Deliver yourself from the spirit of knack and fry eggs. <laughs> I mean, a few tweaks here and there and your love life will definitely thank you for it. For this reason, I have decided to show you one of my favorite breakfast options pancakes and Harvard graduate omelette. Not the omelette that went to the one that finished from Harvard. Yes. So if you're interested in this, keep watching the video. Wait, 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 hold up. <laughs> have you subscribed to my channel yet? Why? Did I offend you? Yeah, sorry. Please subscribe to my channel, click on the like button, drop a comment and share so that more people will see this. Thank you. So for this recipe we need red, green and yellow bell peppers, onions, ginger and garlic. We also need eggs, diced chicken, sausages, avocado, grapefruit cheese, frozen mixed vegetables, chili pepper, some salt and some seasoning. Oops, I totally forgot to add oil to the recipe. I'll be using rapeseed oil, but feel free to use any oil available to you. So the first step will be to dice everything that we'll be using. So that's the onions. I'm going to be dicing the onions. I need them to be as tiny as possible as small as possible and finely chopped so that was the ginger and that's the garlic as well so I'm gonna be dicing the peppers as well the red pepper had just been done I'm gonna do the yellow next and then the green pepper so dice as um, finely as you can so the next thing would be to mix up all the finely chopped vegetables with the diced chicken sausages um, the avocado as well should be diced by now and mixed into this as well. And then we add the frozen mixed vegetables. Yeah, we mix all of that together. Then we add some salt, some pepper and some seasoning. Then give it a thorough mix before setting aside. So that's it. You add that, give it a good mix, mix it well, mix it up well. Then we set aside. And we move to the next thing. For this recipe, I'll be using four eggs. I've cracked those open into um, a bowl and I've added some seasoning, some pepper and some salt. And I'm whisking it properly to let the yolk mix well with the egg white. So that's done. The fry pan had been set on fire now and I added some oil, just very little oil. Oh wow, I I lost some footage, but what I had done with the first egg, you saw that there was some egg that had already been done. That's the same thing I'm doing again. So you just pour the egg, you add the mixed vegetables and everything, and then you put some grated cheese beef. I personally like to be very generous with my cheese, you know. I just put as much as I as it can take. It is important to note that your cooker should be set to the lowest heat. You want the omelette to cook properly without getting burnt. So you leave it, you let it cook. Then, okay, now I'm trying to turn it because one side is already cooked. So I flipped it. I had to like cut it into two because I couldn't flip it at once. So now you, you flip it, you let the other side cook as well. Like I said, lowest heat. We don't want it burning. So you just let it cook, 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 and then we're done. So now the table has been set for my king. I'm just gonna add some syrup and breakfast is ready. That's it. Breakfast is ready. 
so before you go do not forget to subscribe to my channel drop a comment like and share thank you so very much until i see you again in my next next